Here's an example of the line of best fit. So on a hot day, six cars were left in the sun. The length of time each car was left in the sun was recorded, as well as the temperature inside the car. So our time is going to be our x variable. So that's going to go on our x-axis. That's your independent variable. And then your temperature, your y-axis, your independent variable, will go on the y-axis. So you would graph out these ordered pairs. So I'll just show you one of them. So over 50, up 47. And then you continue graphing out the rest of those ordered pairs. Now, part A. They want you to calculate the mean for x and the mean for y. So we've done this on a previous video, so just review with you. You're going to go ahead and add all the x values together. And then divide it by how many data points there are. And there are six ordered pairs. So divide it by six. So the mean is 30. Then you're going to do the same thing for your y values, add them up, and then divide by 6, and you get the mean for y is 38. So that is going to be graphed on your scatter plot right there. Then what you're going to do is you're going to, let's change colors here, graph a line of best fit that's going to run through that mean point. And you always want to make sure you label that mean point. Now part D, predict the temperature of a car which has been left in the sun for 35 minutes. So when we go up, you'll go to 35, on the x-axis, go vertically up to that orange line where it touches, and then go horizontal and read what that number is. So it's predicted that if you have uh, 35 minutes, that the temperature would be 40 degrees Celsius. Part II is asking for 75 minutes. So you go over on the x-axis, and then over, and you would read that number, which is 55. But there's a problem with that prediction. It's considered outside the poles. So if we under look back here, here's the lowest, and that's the highest. So you can only make predictions between those black region. So this is considered an extrapolation. So you can't make a prediction. So the answers are shown below here. When your x value is 35, your y value is 40. So the temperature in the car left in the sun for 35 minutes will be 40 degrees. Whereas when you went to 75, you can't make a prediction because it's considered outside the poles. So this is considered unreliable due to extrapolation.